How to create a target card widget. To create a target card widget, navigate to widgets on the MSP Bot Apps menu. Click the new widget button. Select the target card widget type. When the widget builder window appears, give your widget a name, a short description of what the widget is for, and add the role that needs access to your widget. Click the apply button. Go to dataset. Click the plus sign button. Click New Layer on the Add New Layer window. On the Dataset window, select a data source and give your data source a name. Add columns by selecting an option from the column name drop down list. Assign an alias and business type. Click the plus icon to add more rows. Add a filter by clicking Add Condition. Select a field from the drop-down list and enter your preferred condition. Add a measure by clicking the plus sign to show the measure window. Select a summarize type. Choose the column name that needs to be measured and give the measure an alias. Select the format type, click Add, click Save. Go to Config. Under Fields, select the measure that you would like the target card to show. Under User, Select the KPI or metric owner name from the drop-down list. Selecting a user will activate the widget and will start taking snapshots of the target card. If left blank, it will not record any snapshot. Under Refresh Cron, select the frequency for the widget to take a snapshot of the target card. Under Benchmark, set the target score of the widget. Select Class Days, set the numbers of day to limit the graph dimension. Under Header Text, set the Measure Label. Under Trend Line, select a preferred trend line on the drop-down list if necessary. If you need to add conditional formatting for your widget, go to Condition and add a rule. Provide a widget rule name. Click Add Condition, select the field where the rule must apply, and add your preferred condition. Click Background Color and set the color for this rule. Click Apply. Click Apply again on the widget. 
This will show a preview of the target card widget that you created. It will appear empty on the first day of your widget creation because there is still no record of snapshots in the widget. Once it has obtained records of snapshots, a preview in the form of a line graph will appear on your widget. Go to Snapshots to see the recorded snapshots for this target card widget. And that is how you create a target card widget. For more information about our MSP Bots product, you may reach out to your designated MSP Bots representative or reach out to support at mspbots.ai.